Hello friends, welcome to Excel in Career. In this tutorial, we are going to learn random forest regression. So you can watch my previous video on decision tree regression. So what is random forest regression? So applying decision tree multiple number of times, this is random forest regression. So here are some steps. So firstly, rather than choosing all the all the data set, we are choosing only endpoints from the training data set and we build the decision tree regression model from these endpoints. So how we build the decision tree regression model you can watch my previous video so let's say the example of the house prediction price we have the x1 x2 x3 are the independent variable and the dependent variable is the price of the house that is y so we build the decision tree regression model means we fit the curve and the small small subgroup takes place and and for each small group we calculate the average and we calculate the average value of y and and if a test data is lies in a particular subgroup, the average value of this particular group is given to that y predict. So I think you understand that how decision tree works. So for the random forest regression, we repeat the step one and two, and after that we take the average of all the y value and given to the y predict. So I think you understand that how random forest regression works. So you can watch my previous video. I have explained in detail about decision tree regression, uh, different libraries. So firstly, for random forest regression, we import all the libraries and data pre-processing part is done. You can watch my previous video on data pre-processing part, how to handle missing data, encoding categorical data, feature scaling. Uh, after that, we have we have calculated the value of x and y. We want x and y in in a numpy array. So x is a independent variable array and y is a dependent variable array. And after that, we import train uh, train test split. So we split the data and let's say the test size is 0.2. So here we have 80% is given to train the model and 20% we check how our model is accurate. And after that we import random forest regression. So after importing the random forest regression, we call the random regression class with random set 42 and an estimate is 12. And we fit the curve x and y and we get the value y predict after we call the regression dot predict and we check the y predict and the y test and we calculate the accuracy of the model so i think you understand that how random forest regression works so in next tutorial we will uh, we will learn something new and after that we create a project by applying all the regression model and we we will check which one is the best for which condition